remember specifically this one moment where my dad's friend's nephew came over and he was playing like all these classic rock songs and I just felt the energy in the room, his ability to translate his feelings onto the guitar and from that moment I said, okay, this is something that I want to take serious. When you learn music theory, you focus on like how something makes you feel. <laughs> Voicing those notes on different instruments comes with different personalities. I, I, I akin the analogy to when people say they speak another language, it's almost as if they develop another personality because of the the way they say certain phrases, I would akin that to learning different instruments. You're playing the same notes, but you play it in a different way. And you have these tonalities that come out of you that add to what it means to be a unique artist. So I have like a keyboard with uh, like 600 different sounds on it. So that's been nice and kind of expanding my musical ear. Being a musician is different than playing music. You know, if you play music, then it's just like you play music and it's it's something that you kind of just do, but and maybe it's like a form of therapy, but it's it's very personal. But when you're a musician, you make that like a part of your personality. Being a musician, you're always on the lookout for that new sound. Like we have the dishwasher running in the background right now, and I'm listening and I hear rhythms within the dishwasher, you hear rhythms within the train, you know, you hear the birds singing outside. So there's music like all around. Being able to feel like an emotion and like replicate it through music I think is one of the greatest things that we have developed as a society. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it.